considering the having to come back from a couple goals and, and a couple spots? What's your thoughts on how this one ended up here tonight? We felt like we played better tonight. Um, you know, another great crowd, so we've got to give kudos to our fans. It was awesome again. Um, you know, we got down 2 nothing is not ideal, right? But we, we kept battling back. Um, I think we were behind the whole game, right? So stayed with it, stayed with it, and, and ultimately tied it up there and had some really good chances late, too. Um, yeah, you know, Fair State came in and played well, but, but we played a lot better tonight than we did last night. That's super aggressive down on the ice there tonight. Kind of what we've seen from kind of like how your team kind of fired up and, and kept moving through. Um, it was it was a spirited game. Uh, we were trying to, you know, get our guys to make sure they kept control of their emotions, knowing that with a crowd like that in the building, sometimes the building can can dictate some calls based on the loud, you know, how loud it is and the emotion in the building. Um, you know, we we felt like we, uh, for the most part, maintained our discipline, and and uh, the special teams was. You know, did a better job tonight than, than last night. The power play did a, did a good job, you know, getting us back to even, and and the PK did a good job when they needed to. Um, but yeah, it was just a it was a great college hockey game. Unfortunately, we, you know, again, it's a, it's a tie. We do, we lose the extra point, but we're proud of our guys for battling back and getting the tie. Can you talk about the lineup choice, sir, and the shootout coach. Uh, first, second one you've had in two weeks. Right? Yeah, so we just went with the same three guys that we did up at, at St. Thomas. Um, Chase made a great move. Uh, good for him. You know, their first guy made a real nice move. Um, Schneid's made a good move. Uh, their goalie made a good save. Stove made a couple good saves, and their fourth guy made a really nice move. And uh, unfortunately, we couldn't we couldn't match it. But uh, yeah, we went with the same three that we that did a good job up at St. Thomas. So yeah, I had some great opportunities there right at the end of regulation. I think uh, Austin had a breakaway. You had several breakaways in the game, weren't able to convert. Yeah, we had. Uh, you know, again, as far as. How we played and and what we value, uh, you know, their goaltender played really well uh, tonight. Uh, played well all weekend, uh, but yeah, we had we had uh, Norris had a breakaway, made a good move. Goalie made a good save. Uh, I think Zach Vanell had a kind of a mini breakaway. Goalie made it. You know, he was square. He didn't give him much. Uh, we had we had some chances. I think Nathan Burke shot at the very end of regulation, hit the crossbar, uh, and, and went out. But. Uh, we created some some really good opportunities, and not not the, and, and Ferris did as well, but we felt like from our perspective, we played much better tonight in, in doing what, what we want to do. We still have some things that we need to clean up, but uh, we did create some great chances. Seems like Christian started a little shaky, but he got a little solid ground. Yeah, he had to make yeah, yeah you know he had to make um, some really good saves. You know, um, tough tough start. You know, the shorthander, and it's just a. It's a difficult spot to put your goalie in. We turn a puck over right there, and it's a it's a two on zero. The first one was tipped, you know, from a ways away. Um, the fourth one hits off him and goes up in the air. So some some tough bounces for him, uh, but he had to make some big saves as well. So uh, glad, you know, proud of him for battling the way he battled. Um, could you just talk through uh, that challenge you wanted to make on Pre-Sunday? Yeah. Um, we felt we asked upstairs, so so Barber gets hit, and, and it happened so fast, and it was obviously a really hard hit. Um, we felt like there was the potential for head contact. Um, the, the referees didn't see it that way. Uh, you know, Barber's in a, he's got his head down, he's in a defenseless position, but ultimately they didn't see it the same way our, our people up top saw it. But uh, the, the good thing is he was okay. You know, that was a pretty hard hit. Austin streak over, I think, too, isn't it? After yeah, I think so. Yeah, he had he had a, a good chance there in the second. Barber fed him a, a puck on the power play, or right in tight there, and he was around. I he, I could tell he was he was gripping his stick a little bit and and uh, pressing to maybe try to try to get on the on the board. And he had a you know he had a good chance there at the end, and um, you know he's he's maturing as a player, and he just got to continue to to do the the little things and let the game come to him versus try to try to force stuff. Uh, which sometimes we, we did this weekend against a good defensive team. <coughs> how much did the players, I know we're, we're still down 2 1, but how much did the players enjoy the, the Teddy Bear toss? Yeah, I mean, it, it, there was a lot of them. You know, I'm glad we were able to get it out of the out of the way in the first period. Um, but yeah, it, it, it was uh, something that, that uh, it, it's it's for a good cause, and I'm, I'm glad we were able to, to do it in game like we did and, and 
go from there. But they, I think everybody enjoyed it. You know, as every other sport on campus, Coach, would, would die for half the crowd you had tonight. You touched on that already. Um, the atmosphere in this arena, I mean, it's just very special. Yeah, it, it's, it's, it's awesome. And, and, and again, um, you know, we'd love to win every time we play here. You know, we had a nice run going, and, and unfortunately last night we couldn't keep it going. You know, tonight, it, the good thing is, is we gave them lots to cheer about. Uh, um, they enjoy coming here. It's a, it, it has, you know, our team plays hard, and and the games are exciting, and and the building's exciting, and yeah, it's Slater Family Arena is a, a great building. Unfortunately, we weren't able to win uh, this weekend, uh, but we we played our our tails off tonight and played hard and, and didn't quit and kept going, and and uh, you know we we're a little banged up. We you know minus uh, you know Quinn Emerson was out tonight with a lower body injury, and Jack Blake's out, and you know we got some some guys on the, on the mend and hopefully uh we can you know pick ourselves up and be ready to go monday with a tough series next week